Hello, my name is Clarence, and today I'm going to make meatloaf. These are my main ingredients. I've got turkey meat, because I want it to be a little healthy. I've got ground beef, and i got two Italian sausages. And I'm going to throw in some vegetables. I'm going to have some celery, carrots, onions, a little parsley for herbs, and then two eggs as binders, and breadcrumbs as well, which kind of holds everything together. So basically what I'm going to do is just prep everything, chop all the vegetables, um, and then I'm going to throw it all into a bowl and mix it up, and it's pretty easy. It's just a loaf of meat. All right, step one, put all your meat in a bowl, a mixing bowl. All right. Now step two is to prepare all your vegetables. So I'm going to start off with the onion and then the garlic. Onion, I'm going to actually use the food processor. Alright, so the first few steps are done. You've prepped your vegetables, you've got your meat in the bowl. Um, now it's time to do a preliminary mix, which is just incorporate everything together and make sure it's finely mixed and uh, everything's loafy and nice. Alright, so now you've done your preliminary mix. Um, now it's time to add the seasoning. Now at this point you can also add your egg um, and your breadcrumbs, which are going to be the binding agents which hold the loaf together. And it's important to have a loaf that is held together. Now it's time to uh, transfer your meatloaf to a loaf pan so it has that loaf look. Now as an extra bonus to finish off uh, the pièce de résistance, um, I like to cover the meatloaf with bacon, uh, like just two slices, because really you probably don't have enough fat in this meatloaf. Now you're ready to cook the uh, meatloaf, so it just basically goes into an oven for about 
an hour at about 375 to 400 degrees. Um, you can check it periodically. Alright, I'm going to just taste a little bit for all of you, and also for myself. Mmm. It's really good. Not bad for just mixing up a bunch of stuff in a bowl.